हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज राजकुमार ठेनवा टू डे आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट द प्रीलोडिंग ऑफ द कॉन्स्टेंट्स वैल्यूज इन अ सिमिलिंग मॉडल मेनी टाइम्स यू हैव सीन दैट यू आर यूजिंग सम कॉन्स्टेंट्स इन योर सिमिलिंग मॉडल एंड वेन एवर यू वॉन्ट टू सिमुलेट योर सिमिलिंग मॉडल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू इनिसलाइज दो वैल्यूज इन साइड द मैट लैब आफ्टर दैट यू विल बी एबल टू रन द सिमलिंग मॉडल बट यू वॉन्ट टू जस्ट सिमुलेट द मॉडल without initializing all these value you want that uh, all these value should be initialized automatically when we load the simlink model so today i will show you how you can do that so let's see so for that uh, open the simlink create one simple model so i am just taking one sine wave okay and uh, taking gain block so i am taking two gain block okay and uh, after that just to show the output i am using scope right so just to copy you can uh, press the control and then drag so it create one copy okay now i just change the value of this to some constant like k1 okay apply and the value of this gain as k2 okay so uh, definitely uh, when i will run this program it will uh, create some error right because uh, we don't have the value of k okay k1 and k2 so either you can uh, fix uh, this by using the load of file into base workspace right or create a new variable uh, i am not discussing about this at this time so i am just telling you how you can preload the values when you open the simlink model okay so for that you have to just go to the modeling then model setting in your simlink uh, there may be some different option but uh, you have to go to the model properties okay so based on the simlink version there may be some variation so you have to go to the callbacks and in the callbacks there is a preload function right so in the preload function you can write the values of k1 suppose i am writing k1 is equal to 5 and k2 is equal to 10 okay at this place you can write all the matlab commands also you can uh, give the name of any file here so that file will be execute uh, when this model will load okay just apply okay so at this time it will not work you have to first close the model and before closing you have to save the model okay so save the model so this is pre load underscore example right and now you can close this okay now open the model again so pre load so at this time you can check here i'm just showing you the matlab workspace it is clear right so once i will open this model the workspace will loaded by the value of k1 and k2 right so you can check here k1 and k2 are automatically initialized now you can run the model okay and you can check the output right so the concept is very simple but it is very useful when you will do some uh, large programs uh, at that time you can definitely use this so i think you uh, definitely you have enjoyed this concept and you can utilize it later on so if you have enjoyed this lecture please like this lecture and share with your friends thank you